Hi, this is Ty Pendlebury with a review of the Sony BDP S5100. With Blu-ray players now so cheap and so versatile that they make a great alternative to a streaming player, the Sony BDP S5100 is a decent model that accepts most digital formats and has an attractive menu system as well. Build-wise, it's just okay, as while it's compact in size, the door on our unit wasn't attached very well. The player looks attractive though with a jewel-like finish. Likewise, the remote is easy to use, attractive, and you won't go accidentally hitting the Netflix button like on some others. Be aware that if you're buying this player for someone else, that it only has digital outputs, so you won't be able to use it with a CRT. The player comes with what the company calls Super Wi-Fi, but based on my testing, it's certainly not faster than a speeding bullet, though it may still wear its underpants on the outside. The player offers 3D playback in addition to DLNA streaming, but there are no fancy screen mirroring features. Plus, the web browser is pretty bad with no flash support. Streaming video is pretty good, though most of these players' connections aren't currently fast enough for true HD quality from Netflix. Blu-ray and DVD quality is very good with a crisp, clear picture. And while it did fail one synthetic test, it's something I didn't see on real-world applications. At a street price of $90, the Sony offers good value for money and pretty much all of the apps you'll need. This has been Ty Pendlebury for CNET.com.